neutral current is a crucial aspect to consider in the operation and maintenance of medium voltage transformers. It refers to the flow of current through the neutral conductor in a three-phase electrical system. Understanding and managing neutral current is essential for maintaining the stability, safety, and efficiency of medium voltage transformer installations. The video provides an in-depth analysis of neutral current in medium voltage transformers, including its function, influencing factors, control and mitigation methods, potential issues and challenges, and best management practices. By gaining a comprehensive understanding of neutral current, professionals in the electrical industry can ensure the reliable and optimal performance of medium voltage transformers. The neutral current in medium voltage transformers is an important concept to understand for anyone working with electrical systems. It refers to the flow of electric current through the neutral point of the transformer. In simpler terms, it's the current that flows back to the power source through the neutral wire. What are neutral current transformers? Neutral current can be defined as the current that exists in a three-phase electrical system where the loads are imbalanced or the loads themselves generate harmonics. It usually occurs when the currents in the three phases are not equal or when there is a presence of zero-sequence currents in the system. A neutral current transformer is a type of current transformer used to measure the current in the neutral conductor of a three-phase electrical system. In a three-phase system, the current flowing in each phase is not always equal, which can cause a difference in potential between the neutral and ground. A neutral current transformer can help detect this imbalance by measuring the current flowing in the neutral conductor. Neutral current transformers are commonly used in power distribution systems to monitor the balance of the system and detect any faults or abnormalities that may occur. They are also used in protective relaying systems to trip circuit breakers in the event of an imbalance in the system. In addition, neutral current transformers are used in power quality analysis to measure the harmonic currents in the neutral conductor. Harmonic currents can cause power quality issues such as voltage distortion and can also cause overheating of equipment. By monitoring the harmonic currents using a neutral current transformer, these issues can be identified and addressed. Why is neutral current important? Understanding neutral current is crucial because it helps in identifying and resolving potential problems in electrical systems. Excessive neutral current can lead to overheating, voltage distortion, and even damage to equipment. By understanding and managing neutral current, the overall system reliability and efficiency can be improved. Understanding the Role and Importance of Neutral Current In a three-phase electrical system, the neutral point acts as a reference point for the flow of current. It ensures that the difference in currents between the three phases is balanced. The neutral point is typically connected to the ground to provide a stable reference potential. Neutral current plays a vital role in balancing the currents in a three-phase system. It helps prevent voltage imbalances, reduces disturbances, and ensures the reliable operation of electrical equipment. By flowing through the neutral wire, it allows for the return of unbalanced currents and helps maintain a stable voltage across the system. Understanding Factors Influencing Neutral Current in Medium Voltage Transformers 1. Unbalanced Loads and Neutral Current When the loads connected to a transformer are not evenly distributed among the three phases, it results in unbalanced currents. This imbalance can cause an increase in neutral current, potentially leading to overheating and voltage fluctuations. 2. Harmonic distortion and its impact on neutral current. Harmonic distortion refers to the presence of unwanted frequencies in the electrical system. Nonlinear loads such as computers, variable speed drives, and lighting systems can introduce harmonic currents. These harmonic currents can cause increased neutral current and voltage distortion, impacting the performance of the transformer. 3. Nonlinear loads and neutral current. Nonlinear loads, which draw non-sinusoidal currents, can contribute to an increase in neutral current. These loads often generate harmonics and can lead to higher neutral currents, resulting in overloaded neutral conductors and potential system instability. Methods to control and mitigate neutral current. 1. Grounding techniques for neutral current management. Proper grounding techniques, such as solid grounding, impedance grounding, or ungrounded systems, can help manage neutral current. Grounding the neutral point provides a low impedance path for the unbalanced currents and reduces the risk of equipment damage. 2. Neutral Current Transformers, NCTs Neutral current transformers, NCTs, are specifically designed to measure and monitor neutral currents. By installing NCTs, it becomes easier to detect excessive neutral currents, take corrective measures, 
and prevent potential problems in the electrical system. 3. Resistor grounding and compensation. Resistor grounding and compensation methods involve the use of resistors to limit the flow of neutral current. By introducing resistance in the neutral grounding path, the excessive neutral current can be reduced, ensuring a balanced system and protecting equipment from potential damage. Potential issues and challenges associated with neutral current. 1. Overloading and overheating due to neutral current. Neutral current can cause some serious problems if left unchecked. One major issue is overloading and overheating of the transformer. When the neutral current exceeds the rated capacity of the transformer, it can lead to excessive heating and potential damage. This can result in costly repairs or even the need for a complete replacement. So, it's important to keep a close eye on the neutral current to prevent any unwanted fireworks. 2. Voltage imbalance and quality issues. Another challenge posed by neutral current is voltage imbalance. When the neutral current is not properly distributed among the phases, it can create voltage imbalances and affect the quality of the electrical supply. This can cause equipment malfunctions, flickering lights, and other annoying electrical gremlins. Nobody wants a power supply that's as unstable as a Jenga tower, so it's crucial to address this issue promptly. 3. Resonance and Harmonics Did you know that neutral current can also have a melodious side? Well, sort of. When there is a high level of harmonics in the system, it can lead to resonance issues. These harmonics can be caused by various factors like non-linear loads, faulty equipment, or even mischievous gnomes. Just kidding about the gnomes, they're harmless. Resonance can cause additional stress on the transformer and other components, resulting in inefficiency and potential failures. So, keep an ear out for any harmonic symphonies and address them accordingly. Best Practices for Dealing with Neutral Current in Medium Voltage Transformers 1. Regular Monitoring and Maintenance To avoid any neutral current nightmares, regular monitoring and maintenance are essential. By keeping a watchful eye on the neutral current levels, you can detect any abnormalities early on and take preventive measures. Just like going to the doctor for a checkup, regular maintenance ensures the overall health and longevity of your transformer. 2. Load Balancing Techniques Load balancing is like a game of evenly distributing the cookies among your friends. By distributing the load evenly across the phases, you can reduce the neutral current and minimize the risks associated with it. This can be achieved by rearranging loads or using techniques like phase-shifting transformers. So, if you want your transformer to have a fair cookie distribution policy, load balancing is the way to go. 3. Proper Selection and Sizing of Transformers Choosing the right transformer is crucial for neutral current management. By selecting a transformer with an appropriate rating, you can ensure that it can handle the expected neutral current without breaking a sweat or overheating. Additionally, properly sizing the transformer based on the expected load can prevent overloading issues. Just like Goldilocks finding the perfect porridge, selecting the right transformer helps maintain the electrical balance. In conclusion, neutral current plays a critical role in the operation of medium voltage transformers. By understanding its significance and implementing effective management strategies, electrical professionals can ensure the smooth functioning and longevity of transformer installations. Balancing loads, employing appropriate grounding techniques, and monitoring for potential issues are key practices for neutral current control. As the electrical industry continues to evolve, it is essential to stay updated on emerging technologies and advancements in neutral current management. By doing so, we can proactively address challenges, improve transformer performance, and promote the overall reliability and efficiency of medium voltage power systems.